Recent events have sparked conversations on what the future holds for the U.S. Democratic and Republican parties. KHQA's Sarah Rosenthal spoke with local political experts about their thoughts on what's next for the country. Tri-state political experts share with me that it is more important than ever for both the Democratic and Republican parties to unite. They say it'll take cooperation amongst everyone to move the country forward. Dr. Chad DeWard serves as chair of Culver Stockton College's political science department. He says the country now faces an unprecedented array of unique challenges as the inauguration of President-elect Joe Biden nears. Dr. DeWard says he believes voters want to see the parties work together to help restore a functioning Public. My, my thinking is that, that uh, voters want uh, some calm, uh, they, want, they want some deliberation, they want some, some type of, of, of consensus rather than uh, launching into uh, revolutionary changes. Meanwhile, Quincy University president and political expert Dr. Brian McGee thinks Biden might have an easier time getting his appointees approved. But Dr. McGee adds that the narrow control will leave little margin for error for Democrats. Any member of the Democratic Party in Congress um, doesn't want to do what uh, President Biden wants to do. It's going to be very hard for President Biden to accomplish it. So it's going to be difficult uh, for the Democrats, even though they do hold both houses. Dr. McGee stresses that concerns in the tri-states align with those throughout the entire country. We need, to, we need to agree on what the truth is going forward. We cannot have a country where Democrats have one reality and Republicans have another. We cannot be in a world where we always assume that people on the other side are lying. Um, if we have that, we can't have a productive politics, we can't make decisions, we can't make progress as a nation. Those I spoke with agree that unity amongst everyone needs to take place in order to move the country forward. In studio, Sarah Rosenthal, KHQA News.